it's a fundamental piece of appreciative inquiry, the 4D cycle. Sometimes it's called 5Ds because you've got to figure out and define the topic first. You know, in strategic planning, we use a model called SOAR, which takes the best of, you know, those of you familiar with SWOT, strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. Appreciative inquiry practitioners take the best of that, the strengths, the opportunities, add the aspirations and the results, and get an acronym that is much more inspiring, the SOAR methodology. So there's other methodologies, but this is the one that I wanted to spend a little time on today, which is the 4Ds. And the most important part of this diagram is actually the center. 